Hey everyone, Edward here at Windows Report and in this video I will show you how to fix the Windows 11 update error code 0x8070103 in no time. So the first solution that you should always take in consideration is to run the Windows Update Troubleshooter. To do this, press the Windows button, then select the settings icon and afterwards make sure that system is selected on the left pane and then on the right side scroll down until you find the troubleshoot category and click on it. Now in here click on other troubleshooters and afterwards select the run button next to Windows Update. Windows will now try to detect any issues and fix them as soon as possible. You can then restart your computer and check if the problem still persists. Moving on, another useful solution is to restart the Windows Update service. To do this, press the Windows button, then type in Services and then select Services as an app from the search result. Now in here, as you can see, the list is quite long. So what you can do is simply click on a random service and then type the first letter of the service that you're looking for. In our case, it's W. And scroll down until you find the Windows Update service. Now double click on it. And from here on, under the service status, make sure to stop the service by clicking on the stop button. And now the last thing you have to do is to restart the service. So click on the start button and wait a bit until the service will start. Click on apply and OK to save the changes, restart your computer and check if the issue still persists. Moving on, another useful solution is to hide the updates from reinstalling. To do this, press the Windows button then type in Control Panel. Now select Control Panel from the search results and from here on select System. Now in here select Advanced System Settings under Device Specifications and then in the System Properties window click on the Hardware tab. In here the next step is to click on device installation settings under the device installation settings category and now the last thing that you have to do is select the no option and from here on the above process will prevent windows from reinstalling driver updates already on your system. You can then click on save changes, restart your computer and check if the problem still persists. Moving on another great solution is to simply delete the windows temporary files. To do this, press the Windows button, then type in Run, and then select Run from the search results. Now, in the Run window, make sure to type in the following path. And, as you can see, we are directly in the temporary folder. Make sure to select everything by pressing on Ctrl plus A, and then Shift Delete to permanently delete all the temporary files. Confirm once again by pressing on the Yes button, and then wait until all the files will be deleted. Now, if you find out that there are some files that cannot be deleted because they're using some of your services, just let them be, then close this window, restart your computer and check if the issue still persists. However, as an alternative, we highly recommend you to try out Restoro, which is an app that specializes in scanning and repairing any issues with your Windows operating system faster than you think. At the same time, Restoro also repairs damage caused by malware, which is a great plus in functionality. So make sure to check out the link in the description below. And that's it, super simple, isn't it? Of course, if you enjoyed the video, make sure to hit the like button and as usual, subscribe to our channel for more useful content. Thank you.